world, I'm Maya Sundermeyer and I would like to welcome you to the latest episode of my blog series. So far, I've shared my experiences with you of what it's like for me to live with autism. Other times, I like to give my two cents as to what's going on with autism in the media. And finally, I will cover topics that I am passionate about that have absolutely nothing to do with autism whatsoever. And in this video blog, I would like to continue to talk about my life experiences. And I wanted to also mention to you guys, if you have checked out um, two of my uh, latest videos, uh, Being True Blue to Your School, and the second one is Proud to be Co-Chair. And for those of you who are just joining my channel and are starting to watch my blogs, uh, I am currently working for the Center for Leadership and Disability at Georgia State University and one of my jobs that I'm doing is I'm mapping autism resources across the state of Georgia uh, to light up the way for individuals with autism and their families so that they can get better services and supports and hopefully uh, we'll be able to educate the general public about how to handle autism and make society a better place. But anyway, I also mentioned too that um, I have been involved with a planning committee and uh, that committee is uh, going to put together a, a brand new conference which uh, premieres next week. It's called the Autism Conference and Exposition of Georgia. And uh, my role has been to work on the volunteer program and one of my goals was to uh, get other individuals like myself on the spectrum to go and volunteer and the reason why I would like to do that is because again we are trying to get individuals on the spectrum out into the community and we are trying to uh, prove to the world that we're not these monsters that have a huge lack of empathy and we're trying to show the world that we don't have a disability we have a human detour system and we think differently than most people and that we can put that difference uh, to the test so Anyway, here's what's going on. Uh, I have a few friends of mine that are on the autism spectrum, and a few of them have never really uh, held down jobs before. I mean, one of them has tried working in a sheltered workshop on a few occasions, but it's never really worked out for them because they always end up uh, having panic attacks and having meltdowns because uh, the stimuli is just too great for them. And then the other one has, uh, you know, just likes to run around and goof off. But his mother is trying to uh, get him into a work-related environment because if you introduce him to things too fast, uh, he'll flip out as well. So, uh, I what I what I thought I would do with them next Monday or not, not next Monday, but uh, next Wednesday is uh, I'm going to help them greet other people and I thought I would try and be a mentor with them and help them set examples and I'm thinking if it gets to be too great for them I am going to uh, send them to a sensory friendly suite which was one of my ideas I thought that uh, if we're going to have a conference with people on the autism spectrum or that uh, that are going to be at a conference where things are going to be too great for them they need a place where they can unwind and a place where they can calm down and a place where they can stim and be themselves. So uh, anyway, uh, again, I'd like to welcome you to my channel. Uh, for those of you just joining, please be sure to check out my videos, uh, Being True Blue to Your School, and also check out uh, my other video, uh, what's that one? Um, Proud to be a co-chair. And uh, most importantly, please be sure to check out my first introduction video, uh, which is a timeline about my life. So, do not forget to subscribe and comment below. Until next time, I'm Maya Sundermeyer.